My name is Dr. Saika Ismail and uh, I'm one of the consultant psychiatrists at BR Medical Suites, uh, Dubai Healthcare City. We are going to be talking about uh, depression in women because I do believe that uh, depression is a constant threat to women's uh, life cycle. Depression in women can be due to multiple reasons. Can be biological, as in menopausal, teenage, reproductive cycle, vitamin D deficiency, or anemia. Now let's uh, shed some light on the social causes of depression. As in uh, discrimination at work we talked about, as in uh, death of a loved one, or as in divorce. A lot of times what happens is uh, women tend to uh, handle stress in a less productive way than men because of their hormonal issues as in progesterone is one of the hormones as we all know which is a part of female reproductive cycle uh, that tend to you know mask uh, the stress as opposed to me men who lacks progesterone they tend to handle stress very well as opposed to women Now, some of the signs uh, women should watch out for of depression are, you know, there are psychological signs and symptoms as well as physiological signs and symptoms. When we talk about psychological signs and symptoms of depression, they are decreased interest in activities of daily living. The other psychological symptom or sign which women should watch out for is depressed mood or guilt or suicidal thoughts. Now let's talk about physiological signs and symptoms of depression. They can be decreased sleep or increased sleep, decreased appetite or increased appetite or it can be increased weight or decreased weight. So these signs and symptoms should be watched out for. Now, depression might affect women in a different way than it does affect the men. When women are depressed, they feel helpless. They would try to hide themselves as opposed to men. When you see the men, they express their depression as mood irritability, as an agitation. Men try to seek help using alcohol or sexual abuse or something like that versus women they try to you know mask symptoms of depression by not eating by isolating themselves and also decrease libido they have no sexual desire at all what you can do first of all I would recommend that you know if somebody is experiencing signs and symptoms of depression as we talked about you should go first of all see your general practitioner because we need to rule out medical causes of depression if you are experiencing mild to moderate depression you know you it can be dealt with psychotherapy if you are experiencing severe depression you know we can think about medication management along with sessions of psychotherapy besides medication and psychotherapy what one can do to help themselves at home what you normally do is you know get back to your normal schedule as in doing exercise try to get back to normal social life talk to your friends Find somebody you can count on. Find somebody you find trustworthy of. You can share your feelings with. Having said that, now my advice to you as a woman, we should all look out for these signs and symptoms of depression. Thank you so much for watching me. If I can be of any help, it would be my pleasure.